Gregor, what did you see as the difference between the teams today? It was a it was a real tight one out there, but you've just come out on the on the wrong side of it. Yeah, look, it was an arm wrestle that um, was going to be decided by one or two moments. Uh, them scoring that try was was the difference. Uh, we, we'll look at other obviously other opportunities, uh, more errors that we made that could have put us in a better position at, <clears throat> at scoring. But I think that's what I'm winning. But I, I think. Being ahead in the scoreboard and when the ball's a bit wet, um, certainly helped them. And we just couldn't get ahead in that that first half. And obviously, when we went by in the second half, it was always a challenge. Do you describe it as, as as a day of frustration for you and your team? Yes, it always is when when you lose, um, when you don't play your best. Uh, we we knew it was going to be a a game where there would be a lot of kicking, even even before the ball got wet. So in games like that, you you have to work hard, you have to be patient, you have to minimise your errors uh, and you have to make sure that you get on the good side of the referee, which we didn't at times today. Yeah, there was a, a disappointment with the, the penalty that uh, Stuart had at the end there, just to perhaps you know, give yourself one last chance to, to perhaps salvage a draw. Well, I thought, I thought the the effort of our players a uh, number of times during the game was outstanding. Um, France had a couple of penalty advantages, but they moved the ball wide. It looked like certainly they were going to score, and our, our cover tackle was was excellent. Um, so that and the character shown at the end to get that opportunity. Um, and obviously, if we had made touch, it could have given us opportunity of a, a line at a mall. Um, but they, these things happen. But uh, I was really pleased with the character and the toughness are. Our players have showed once more again. Pat Ferguson also sort of stood up. Uh, you've been looking for a big sort of performance in that number eight jersey. How did you, how did you rate his display? Yeah, I'll, I'll find out more when I go through in detail. But um, he, he was prominent and uh, his carries uh, to get 80 minutes out of him after being out injured was was excellent. Uh, but I'm sure there'll be a, a few things like all the players that they've, they've done well and a couple of things they, they would like to take back. Gregor, do you feel that was a, a game you should have got something out of looking back? You mean a win? Because we got uh, we got a bonus point, so we did get something. Well, uh, yeah, I kind of mean a draw or a win, yeah. A draw or a win, yeah. That, that would have been that, that would have been great. In terms of the context of the competition, um, a draw probably would, would leave us maybe in the same position. Uh, we were waiting on on what happens with Italy, France. Uh, and a draw is better than a defeat, yes. And um, to come back and get a draw would have been a would have been a boost. But uh, at least we showed that character that we were we doing all we can to get that that draw. Very similar um, game to the Ireland game. Uh, in terms, of, I think it might be the exact the same score, but uh, we lost by seven points that day, and we had an opportunity at the end to, to get the draw. So. It's tough for the players to take when, when they come so close, but we, we learn a lot from the defeat and uh, we know we, we've got to be better in a couple of weeks' time. I know it's hard straight after a defeat like that, but do, do you feel overall this team is, is moving in the right direction? Are you, are you really pleased with what you're saying? <clears throat> yes. Uh, I think if you look over 2020, we've shown real commitment. Uh, we've shown togetherness, we've shown that we're tough to, to break down, tough to beat. And that was another game that, that underlined that. Uh, but today we we had penalties against us and some errors of execution that um, we know we, we have to eradicate. Uh, and that's attack and defence. Um, we know we have to eradicate if we are going to be um, a team that, that wins these games and reaches a potential. And finally from me, uh, there was an incident with Camille Shah. He lifted his arm into a, a tackle. It was looked at. Um, some people felt he was lucky not to get a red. What, what did you make of it? Well, the, the officials talked it through. Um, Wayne Barnes is an experienced official, so I've got to go with what he says on the field. Okay, thank you. Thanks. Anything further for immediate use?